DigitalKnowledgeBox.com So now you're going to see a grouping of three, two, two, and three screws. You're going to remove the middle one, the outer one, the right one, the far left of this grouping, and the middle of this grouping. So coming from the left, that's the second, the fourth, the seventh, and the ninth screw. Okay. Okay, so hopefully you can see in there I've removed the middle one there, the outer one there, the outer one there, and the middle one here. So that's four screws removed there. And now we are going to remove four more screws that's going to be the on the back here. We're going to remove these outer four screws, the one, two, three, and four. Alright, and with these screws you'll notice that there's a longer one and a shorter one. The longer ones came from the inner uh, portion and the shorter ones on, are on the outer side, outermost. Alright, the next screws we're going to remove are these two screws that uh, are adjacent to where the battery pack is. And you'll start to feel everything sort of loosen up at this point, so you want to be very careful. These, I think, are the smallest screws we've come across yet, little tack screws. So don't let those get away from you. For a complete list of all the tools and a link to where you can actually pick up a replacement DVD drive for your MacBook, please visit digitalknowledgebox.com forward slash Mac DVD replace. There you'll be able to find the complete video download as well as a, a helpful ebook, 50 easy steps to replacing the MacBook optical drive. So again, that's digitalknowledgebox.com forward slash Mac DVD replace. Digital knowledge box dot com.